Yo, it's Cinema Solo here with another Spotlight Review. Spotlight Reviews are when I go back and review movies that either you or I missed that we need to be watching. This week, it's going to be Chef. Okay, so I caught Chef on Netflix last weekend, and it is amazing. You must go see this. Like I said, it's by John Favreau, you know, a.k.a. Iron Man's bodyguard, and also the director of Iron Man. So if you really liked Iron Man, you're probably going to like this movie, too. It has that same quirky humor. Same, you know, friendship bonds and everything. The some of the star of getting cast is, you know, Sophie Vergara from Modern Family, uh, Scarlett Johansson, and even Robert Downey Jr. makes an appearance, and he is funny. Uh, along with the cameos from celebrities, uh, this movie has a great story. John Fabio really stands out in this role. He, you know, he starts out as a real accomplished, you know, sought after high-end L.A. chef in a big restaurant. Uh, you know, he has this big review coming up by a guy that loved him 10 years ago. The reviewer shows up, and, you know, John Favreau just is like, hey, I want to make this new and exciting menu. And the owner of the restaurant is like, no, you're going to make the classics. And he does, like, this weird comparison between him and, you know, the Rolling Stones and about how, oh, if you go to see the Rolling Stones, you want to see the classics. You don't want to see any of that new stuff. And, you know, guilts, you know, John, the chef, into making, you know, the classic menu that the restaurant has. And, you know, evidently, the reviewer just bombs the restaurant and calls out John, you know, and it, it integrates into social media, and the movie just takes off from there. You know, it, it's, you know, John, he, older, and he's disconnected from the social media, and his son, he's also disconnected from him. And it's about him and his son, and, you know, just connecting through social media and, you know, really working his way back up from the ground up. You know, he goes back to his hometown of Miami and he starts a food truck and it's just really good, you know, happy endings all around. I cannot recommend this movie enough. I give it a 9 out of 10. Must watch. It's on Netflix. Go watch it right now. So this has been a spotlight review of the movie Chef. Like I said, it's definitely a must-go-see. Please hit that subscribe button to stay tuned for more spotlight reviews. Uh, I have more coming as soon as I can get them. If you want a movie spotlighted, please lay it down in the comments. Uh, like this video. It really helps me out. If you want to talk to me, hit me up on Twitter at The Cinema Solo. And you can always find me on Facebook and Google Plus at Cinema Solo. Thank you very much. And hit that like button, please. It really helps me out.